Sky in their dark blue with light blue and white numbers. And let's see if Menor can keep it going hot here on the ice. We're underway at the Menor Civic Ice Race with Swenson. Swenson takes it right side. Takes a hard shot on goal, and that's recovered off the rebound. Number 11, Drake Hunter with the goal. Dimitri Danilov sends that one across center ice. Farrington. And we've got another goal. It happened so quick. It was Farrington winning the faceoff. Touch pass to number 26. Early start against Elmira. And then the following Friday, they are away as well against that Port Huron. They return home next December 15th against Danville. But right now, they're home versus Watertown. And we have another power play opportunity and a goal by the Icebreakers. Knock on wood, Moser hasn't given up one in the back of the net. Men are here at the other end of the net. And Declan Conway trying to put it in right side. So is Alvin, and Alvin will. Unbelievable, folks. With 13 minutes and 15 seconds left in the second period. Capitalized, that's where three of their four goals have come from tonight. Lake Health Sports Performance bringing you that power play. Great sponsor, and there it is. They do it again. They do it again with 11 minutes and one second left in the second period. The puck now to Drake Hunter. Drake Hunter, Scott Conway, center ice, fakes it to him and takes another shot on goal with 6-16 left in the second period. Covered by Swenson. Swenson sends it center ice to Bunnell. Bunnell skates through traffic and what a shot on goal for Gordy Bunnell. I had it and it was goes wide left. And the very first thing I'll tell you is that back-to-back -back shutout for Derek Moser. I didn't want to jinx him. But there you go, they celebrate in front of their net. And on the back of a second shutout from Derek Moser and a four-goal game from Drake Hunter, the Men of Icebreakers win this one in the Men of Civic Ice Arena by the final score of 7-0. to zero.